It's beer o'clock on Reload Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Wylam Brewery and it's a bottle of their Swipe Right Session India Pale Ale coming in at 4.7% ABV. There's a look at the label. There's the bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. The beer was kindly sent to us by our channel sponsors beersofeurope.co.uk. Beers of Europe, the largest online beer store in the UK with a fantastic range of beers from all around the world. If you want to check out more, go to the website in our description box, beersofeurope.co.uk. So nice, it was a nice smoke, smoky opening, nice carbonation on the opening. Heard an awful lot about Wylam. I have had one of their beers, very, very good. And well, this beer, this beer has got a three finger white head, slightly hazy beer, good levels of carbonation. I'm looking forward to it. It's a sunny afternoon here in Wales. So I'm looking forward to a beer. It looks to be a naturally hazy beer, so I'm gonna get the rest. I'm not sure, sure if you can see that, but it's quite hazy, that little drop of beer in the bottom of the bottle. So I'm just gonna dump that in just to... Wow, really hazy there, look at that. That one looks like yogurt, can't fault it. It's bottle conditioned, you can see, by the yeast in the bottom of the bottle. Generally, I would leave it out, but it's coming. It's becoming so confusing these days. Do you have a, a completely hazy beer? Do you want to see a completely hazy beer? Generally, people do these days, so you put the yeast in, and then you end up with a little bit of yeast on the bottom of the glass. It's totally harmless, there's nothing wrong with it. In fact, it's full of vitamin B. So we're just going to ignore it for, to, for the trends of 2017. So hazy amber coloured ale, the head's kept itself nice and nice and kind of thick there with a the two finger head. Let's get the aroma. Oh yeah, that smells very tropical. Grapefruity, citrusy. Orange peel, fleshy blood orange. That smells really good. Let's dive in. Cheers everybody. Oh yeah, Stone the Crows. Stone the Crows, what a fantastic beer. Session IPA on the label. Session IPA in the glass. This is for me a super chuggable, drinkable, juicy. You could get the quality of the water as well, that lovely soft water that's coming through. It really helps promote the hops. It puts the hops on a, on a pedestal and it kind of rises in above because you're not thinking about, I know water, you don't think of water as giving off much of a flavor, but when you get the water quality right, in this case, a soft water, it just helps to bind everything together better and promote the hops even more. Grapefruit, orange peel, fleshy blood orange, Fantastic drinkability, good levels of carbonation, not too much, it's super smooth. A little bit of biscuit malt there, a little bit of sweetness, and a nice bitterness on the back end. This, for me, is... I would look to buy four bottles of that. And just chug it away in the garden, just, just keep chugging, chugging, chugging. It's a fantastic session beer. Swipe right. Why is it called Swipe right? The brewer is probably on Tinder. <laughs> or the owner is probably on Tinder. Look, somebody's crushing his heart. I, although I think that, is that a heart? I don't know. Looks like. Rating. I think it's fantastic. A lot of people talking about Wylam Brewery expressing their love for their beers and yeah I'm gonna join in I'm gonna join in I'm gonna say yeah I'm gonna join this Wylam Brewery hype train and drink more of this stuff more often in fact next review will be remain in light 
a super stacked alpha pale at 5%. So look out for that one. Rating for this one, swipe right, the Tinder beer. Good juicy session IPA. The beer looks good, it's that 2017 haze that everybody seems to be brewing. So the beer looks great in the glass. A super beer, I'm gonna rate it as, for me, this is a nine out of 10 all day long. Nine out of 10 from Rido Craft Beer. Super juicy, super hoppy beer. Really, really good to drink. I'd wanna drink four bottles. Thanks for watching. Put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! and cheers.